Ladies and gentlemen, I uh, I bought what had been a grail for a long time, the Seiko uh, SBDX uh, 017, the Marine Master 300, uh, with die shield, still has the tags on it. I uh, received it last night from Seiya Japan, and uh, it looks good in pictures, looks good on video, looks really good up close. I'm not going to lie to you, I, I put it on and it really played too small on me. I'm six feet. I'm um, uh, 240 pounds, and it does not have the lugs north to south. They're not as long as the Sumo, and uh, it for that reason it plays smaller on my wrist than the Sumo, and uh, so I'm going to sell it. I'm selling the uh, MM300. It's a it's a beautiful timepiece, has good build quality, good loom. Uh, it has the uh, the high beat movement that they use in the uh, Grand Seikos. So the uh, situation is I'm going to put it for sale. So uh, in the comment section, you can tell me if you're interested in it or not. Uh, it's probably going to go up on eBay tonight. And uh, it's a shame. I decided to keep the tags on it. Technically, it is used, but it was worn once. And uh, it just plays a lot smaller than I thought. On me, I'm not kidding you. It played like a 40 like a 40 millimeter. It reminded me of my neighbor's uh, 40 millimeter uh, Rolex Submariner. And it, uh, you know, the thickness is nice as you can see. The build quality is nice as you can see. The bracelet fits me out of the box, my 8 inch wrist, pretty loosely, but not so loose that I would remove a link on my 8 inch wrist. And uh, yeah, it's a solid watch, but uh, it just played too small on me. You can get some good shots of it there. I mean, you can see it's an attractive timepiece. But uh, for me, a little too small. Uh, for those of you who, who uh, know about this watch, there's probably not a whole lot I can say about it. Uh, so I'm going to sell it with a whole kit. You know, the, the box, the rubber strap. It even comes with a removal tool, all the paperwork and all that stuff. So pretty much a flawless uh, watch. That's it, man. You can hear the disappointment in my voice, man. I thought I, I had a grail that I was gonna that was gonna sing on my wrist, and for me, uh, I just dwarfed this watch too much. It played too small on me. Uh, looks good here on video. I like to look at close-ups of it. But uh, well, back to the drawing board, ladies and gentlemen. Until next time, I am out.